eyeliner time. Okay, so I've already done this eye with my eyeliner. Um, and I came out a little further than the corner of my eye. I did a tiny bit on the bottom. And I did my waterline. Ladies, if you do not do your waterline, that is okay. But I really think that it makes... I mean, I just think it makes your eyes look more cat-like when you do. Um, and that's kind of what I go for when I do my eyes. Okay, so I always start in the corner as far as I want to go and just drag my eyebrow pencil. Oh, and this is the Linum. Boop. This is Tyra's Linum eyeliner, and it goes on really, really smooth. So, okay, if you just noticed, when I go out to my corners, I bring it in like this until it starts to get awkward, and then I, to hold it that way, and then I flip it around the other direction and just lay it and drag it. I'm laying it flat rather than, like, I can't, I don't know, I guess I could do it that way, but it's best to me, and Put your pinky right here. I don't know how many people do that. I do it. I don't watch many people put on eyeliner, but um, just to give yourself some stability. And I, as you can tell on this eye, barely, barely touched the top of my lash line um, towards the center because I feel like if you just do a really thin line and then out here on the corner, make it thicker that's how it's going to kind of give you a cat more of a cat eye look and i just think that that um makes makes the dark eye shadow look better when you come out thicker and then it makes the white stand out more and it gives your eye more shape when you do it like that so um basically that's how dana does her eyeliner um, I just have to make, I can't wait to get the oops because, um, I love, first of all, liquid eyeliner. Love it. Um, I can't always get them to look the same. I did a pretty good job this go around, um, at making them match. I always have to go back and kind of do a little more here and there, but I think I did a pretty well-rounded job. Um, so now to go to my bottom waterline. This stuff goes so good and smooth on the waterline. That's ridiculous how good that does. And then I just give the little corner down here a little bit of a drag to pull those two together. So anyway, so my eyeliner's done. Next step is 